Hi, my name is Seppo. I'm from Cape Town, South Africa, and I am building Metacode, and it's better code search. So the problem we're solving is that code is a real mess to find. Um, you find yourself, um, you know, in a large code base, searching, uh, doing keyword searches, clicking through a bunch of files, or worse, bothering engineer, bothering other engineers. And this process looks just like this. It's super messy. You're jumping through a bunch of files. You have a bunch of tabs open in your IDE. You're bothering other engineers. There's a project by Google that was uh, sunsetted a few years ago that tried to solve this, but they have it internally now. And so I'll talk about that a little later. The solution looks like this. This is Metacode. So it is a unified view of all the code in your code base. Um, and you can filter by feature, for example, if you're working on a certain segment of code. So even if you're new to the code base, you can immediately get started and know where all the code is. Cool. So here is a video example of how Medicode would be used. Let's say I'm doing a search. Uh, yeah, I'm doing a search in my IDE. It's not very obvious what's going on. So I go and jump into Medicode and I can see all that code. Uh, I hope the video was, I hope, I hope you can see everything that's going on in that video. Um, let's just have it go again. Perfect. Okay, cool. All right, so the market. So the market, uh, I think that Medicode is most useful for teams uh, with more than about three engineers. Reason being that their code base is like growing, but honestly, um, it's useful for everyone. If you're performing any amount of code search, this is useful. So um, we're planning to charge companies $25 per user. Um, and the idea is that we understand that there's around 20 million programmers worldwide, but we only really need to um, reach a percent of them to uh, get to 100 uh, million in yearly recurring revenue. And so this is a paid product for teams. And so, yeah. All right, the summary is that uh, cool. Uh, finding code is time consuming and costly. Engineers spend hours looking for code. Company, companies lose hundreds of thousands a year to, in engineering time because of this. The solution is a Google for code. Um, and uh, yeah, it's better code search for every company. Only like companies like Google, Netflix and such have um, internal tools for this that they've built out. But we're bringing this to every company and we're launching the 1st of August. Cool. Excellent presentation. Uh, and I truly believe this is a Google type problem. Uh, not only do I find that developers personally need to find code quickly, but I think for the company itself, uh, this is always a challenge to sort of have one organizational brain uh, where you can search all your code. So yeah. tell me a little bit about the journey. How do I find and fall in love with your product as an individual developer and right. how do I bring it to my company? Right. So suppose um, I'm an individual developer. I'm working in some company. Their code base is sizable and suppose I'm new to the company. Um, let's say I'm trying to figure out where all this code is. Typically I would be, you know, performing a bunch of searches, um, talking to other engineers, trying to figure out where everything is and how to get started really quickly. And typically that takes a few weeks for an engineer to become really productive in a code base. So a single engineer. So the idea is that um, this is a an app that they can just download for themselves and it scans their entire repository, the local repository. Um, so it will get their cloned version of whatever their team is working on and they'll be able to index their entire code base and really get to searching code really fast. And then they can just bring it into their company. So do you anticipate building connections and integrations into existing systems like VS Code or right. IDEs that people use? Definitely, definitely, definitely. Um, it, obviously, just fitting uh, more neatly into people's like current workflows is really paramount. So yeah, all the like all the best IDEs, VS Code, um, Atom. It, it, it's really meant to be a plug. It's, it's going to evolve into a plugin. And also another, uh, I guess. Um, um, way to scale is um, a lot of organizations have a bunch of repositories that are hosted, you know, in something like GitHub and all that stuff. And so you want a situation where you're able to search that entire code base, for example, like a bunch of different repos. And so a cloud-based solution is also something that we're looking at. So something, um, a, a SaaS web product. Yeah. Interesting, because when I think about where developers put their code, it usually ends up going to the cloud through systems like GitHub and GitLab. But yeah. when they're working, they're always on their local device right. and they're editing and they're needing to re cross-reference code and they might have code that has not been committed yet. So mm -hmm. I could anticipate this being a nice bridge yeah. into the cloud as well uh, yeah. for a lot of those developers. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So uh, as, as a final question from me, uh, tell me about how you see this business evolving. So you mentioned the developer joins the company and they're already using it, but yeah. What's your distribution story and how do you start from something small and then grow into something really big? Yeah, so um, 
obviously we like it's it, you know it, it works on your local um, system um, and the idea is that we acquire, we're basically acquire users through the self-serve product right like the people who are feeling the pain the most um, are going to use the product and uh, evangelize it for, for their teams right they're gonna be like nice. hey um, all of you need to use this it saves you time it saves company money and that's how we acquire users of course um, we'll also just to do you know boots to the pavement um, enterprise uh, just approaching enterprise companies and saying, hey, we have the solution. Google has it. Like, obviously, it's a useful uh, thing. Like, you guys should have it too. <laughs> and so, um, yeah. It'll, it's, yeah. And so, it, it's it's just a combination of like, you know, a direct sales and also just self a, a self serve product that gets evangelized. Um, yeah. Yeah, this is a problem that I see every day with our developer teams. Uh, so I'm really excited about giving this a shot and yeah. seeing where you take it. Yeah. Thank you.